Hey, what's going on everyone? Today is August the 15th, 2022. I'm uh, going to give you all a very quick video about CRISPR Therapeutics, give you all an update as to where I'm seeing the price in this stock going. So today's the first time I've ever seen my videos, my content. Hit the like button, should have been also subscribe here to the channel. Uh, I don't want to waste your time. You know, I understand that so many people like to hype these stocks up. They like to pump it up and you end up buying in on it and the market goes down 50, 60, 70 percent. If you guys want to see how this market really works, this is the spot. You need to follow me. All right. So check this out. I did a video in Christmas Therapeutics on the 18th of July. I was telling you all then uh, that the market was still getting us some bullishness and that the market was going to continue to trend higher. And it did that. Right. 13.72% was continued from the price prediction. Let me go ahead and get that out of the way. And let's talk about what the market has been doing since then. Okay. Because we notice that CRISPR Therapeutics is literally holding. Uh, support right around $73. Where's that at? Uh, I would say around like $73. It's where the market at CRISPR Therapeutics is currently holding support. Okay. We need to identify that and we need to continue to follow this because we know that since we are now trading above the $73 level, that the bullishness and the buyers are currently controlling the environment. They're currently looking to at best continue to trend higher or at best continue to consolidate. Let's identify this consolidation range because not only have we identified the support area, we have also noticed where restriction is. Okay. This is the reason why CRISPR therapeutics cannot go up. It's because the sellers are positioned right there around $85, $86. So now we need to try to figure out, okay, which side of the market is more keen to being broken? Is it the seller's position up here around 85 or is it the buyer's position here around 73? We want to determine which one is going to break because which side is going to break is going to be the determinant factor to let us know which one is going to win and which side we need to be on. Let's look at the market in CRISPR on the weekly chart real quick. Zoom in here. Okay, because you all can see that over the last couple of weeks, uh, namely right here, it's strength. Then the following week, we got weakness, we got more weakness. But then the market here on this week of August the 1st still trended higher. And on this last completed one, we got a probable precursor of strength. So it's a pretty good battle going on between the buyers and the sellers in between these prices. Okay, two weeks chart. We did get some weakness on this last completed two week price bar, but we still able were to inch out closing higher on this last completed two weekly price bar, albeit there was sellers. Okay, yes, sellers are still here in the market in CRISPR. So we are not fully in a bull market just yet in CRISPR. Now I will tell you this on this current three weekly price bar, right? If we see the market close higher than the previous three weeks, then it tells me that the buyers did buy up the selling that occurred into the market in CRISPR and we will be looking for the market to go up. Now I'm looking the first area is going to be around 90 and then my second area is going to be up here towards like 95. Okay. So 90 would be first, second area would be 95. Okay. Yeah, I will tell you that there's been some, especially on the daily time frame, definitely seeing some selling come into the market in CRISPR. So we would definitely have to be careful in that realm for us to be too bullish. We don't want to be too bullish into this particular stock right now uh, because there's definitely been some selling going on into the market in CRISPR. But I think that the strength is beating out the weakness a little bit better. Okay. So I'm going to go ahead and play that out. Okay. We're going to look for the price in CRISPR to continue to trend higher. Um, not yet saying that we're going to break out of this consolidation of range that I've created, but we can see the market move up to 80, 84, 85. That would be my first price target, right? For the see the market in CRISPR run up there to around 85 again. It might fall a little bit lower to 83, 84. I get it, but that's the location. That's the area that I'm looking for the market in CRISPR to run 8.37%. And then after that, I told you. Uh, 90 will be next. Okay, that's around 14%. 
and since I'm not seeing the market as bullish as what I intended earlier I'm not going to push it up there to 95 yet not yet I want us to see how that three weekly price bar is going to end before I bring the market up there to 95 okay so let me hold that I'm gonna hold back on that one so we got 86 85 dollars first and then like 90 second as the price target okay that is it it's your turn real quick real simple give me your ideas to how you think the market and CRISPR therapeutics is going to trade uh, currently I'm still looking for the market to continue to trend a little bit higher and we're just going to see how strong the market really wants to move give me your thoughts make sure you maintain the profitability and as always trade different